Welcome back to Energy Motor Cars. Uh, today, I've got a beast for you. 2022 F450 Lariat. I bought this truck completely stock and I did everything to it, or I had everything done. I don't actually turn wrenches myself, but uh, I'm gonna go over everything that I did to this truck. And um, it's available as of me posting this video. I don't think it's gonna last very long because these F450s are so difficult to get. But uh, what a, what a, absolutely beautiful truck. Um, this truck's antimatter blue, probably looks black um, in most light, but really when you get up on it, um, you can tell that it's, it's this really, really dark blue. It's a beautiful color. And then the other thing that's a little bit different about this truck, try to get the color. Uh, you can, yeah, there you go, you can see the blue in it. The other thing that's a little unique about this truck, not super uncommon, but the Baja interior, um, which I think goes with the blue very, very nicely. It's got upfitter switches, uh, Lariat Ultimate package. So it's got the B&O sound system, your heated and cooled seats. This one has the power running boards, which uh, are a must have in my opinion. But yeah, the black and tan interior, I really like it. Of course, it's a 22, so it's got the big screen. This truck has 900 miles on it. Um, I bought it with uh, about 180, and then I had these wheels made, got them from my friends over at Wheel Dealer, American Force 24 inch wheels. I actually can't remember the specific model name of these wheels, but 24 inch polished American Force wheels. I went with the polished because this truck being a Lariat has the chrome front end and the chrome bumper and I felt like it would look really good and I think it just turned out so, so sharp. F450, of course it has the 6.7 power stroke. I believe it's 475 horsepower and 1050 torque, if I remember correctly. Got the LED quad beam headlights. That's a really, uh, a must have option as well. Uh, but yeah, guys, these 24s. Uh, they look so good on there. Uh, the, for the tire, Middle Ridge Grappler, I went with a 315 50 24. Um, could have done the 37s as well, but as you know, with shortages and stuff, it's very, very difficult to get um, certain parts, and these 315s were, uh, were readily available. It's like a 36 and a half. They're almost identical to the actual 37 13 50. I think really the main difference, the height is about the same. It's about a 37 inch tire, uh, but these are like a half inch narrower which works better on the dualies because the dually wheels are not very wide. I believe they're only eight and a quarter wide. The other thing I did was a three and a half inch Carly uh, leveling kit. It's not considered a lift because it is just the front. Now it has Fox shocks in the rear. Uh, you can kind of see the Carly logo um, on that spring. So Fox shocks, Carly lift, Carly springs. Um, those are the, the Carly valved Fox shocks as well. So Carly does custom valving for the Fox shocks. And then if you can see, it's got uh, Fox shocks in the rear as well. Um, but yeah, there's those big wide dually tires. Um, all six wheels are cut and polished from American Force. This truck has the FX4 package. So you get some skid plates, you get hill descent control truck tows like a dream of course being a big diesel dually truck um, now the rear is, is stock height um, the only thing it has is the wheels and tires so the wheels and tires will set it up just a little bit but uh, the, the it's the stock block stock spring in the rear so you can still tow with this truck you could still probably fit a gooseneck um, of course being an f450 it has I put a bed cover on it it's a truxedo bed cover um, all the f450s have the gooseneck prep so you've got your plug right there, and then you've got your gooseneck slash fifth wheel prep uh, in the bed, all ready to go. Uh, has the tailgate step. Um, like I said, the power boards, which are a must, especially on a truck that sits up this tall. There's the Baja um, interior in the rear. I, I just, I really think it complements the blue really nicely. All the lights look so cool in the front. Um, you got your cab lights and you've got your LEDs along with the amber lights on the headlights and then the mirrors as well. So 
Another cool thing about the Lariat is that uh, you get painted mirror caps and painted door handles, so that looks really nice. Uh, oh, the other thing this truck has is a Kelderman Fox dual steering stabilizer. So we were gonna do um, a single stabilizer until uh, we realized that with the wider track of the F450, um, the, the regular Fox one for like the 350s doesn't work. I think the springs and shocks are all the same on the 350s and 450s, or at least they're interchangeable whenever you're buying a lift kit. But um, the stabilizer was not because the steering is different on the 450s. You actually get a wider track, which makes the turning radius um, far better on the 450s. And that's why they have fender flares because the, like this is a factory fender flare, uh, because the 450s have a much wider track in the front and that's how usually you can tell a 450 from a 350 is by looking at the front fender flares. Of course a uh, stock 450 has 19 fives on it as well but uh, yeah that's kind of a quick quick way to tell. Um, so anyway Kelderman I think was the only one at least what I was told Kelderman is the only one that makes a steering stabilizer for these trucks so um, that's what we went with still has has Fox shocks on it um, like I said, guys, this truck has 900 miles on it. I believe it's 929. Yeah, 929 miles, if you can see it there. And um, it still smells new. It's freshly detailed, um, ready, ready to go. So it does not have a sunroof, which um, some people like it, some people don't. Um, I could go either way. I like sunroofs, but it doesn't bother me that this one doesn't have it. I drove this truck a little bit and um, didn't feel like I missed it. So, of course, it's got um, cruise control and, you know, all your power, everything. Also, tint of the windows. It has ceramic tint on the windows. It is still legal here in Texas, um, depending on where you live. I think I did 25%. It matches the rear, but uh, there's those lights on again. Um, they just look really cool. Oh, just went off. So, yeah. Any questions, give me a call, 281-768-5290. Facebook and Instagram are both at Energy Motor Cars. The website is uh, energymotorcars.com. This truck is priced to sell. Um, you basically cannot duplicate it for what I'm asking because you cannot go get an F450 right now. Um, well, the only way to get one is to find a pre-owned truck uh, and you're gonna pay a big premium for it. So if you're looking for a truck that's done ready to go, bed cover, tinted windows, Carly suspension, American Force wheels. These wheels, they quoted me eight to 10 weeks to get these wheels built. Now I ended up getting them a little bit quicker than that, but if you don't wanna wait and you want a truck that you can just take out right now, tow your toys with, tow your RV, or tow for work, you want it on forces, you want it on 37s, this truck's ready to go today. You do not have to wait on anything. It's done. Give me a call. Be happy to make a deal on it. Thanks for watching, guys.